guys it is me mrs t and today i am doing a walmart easter haul yes my i think it's probably like my first real haul and i went shopping this morning because i'm hosting an easter sunday cookout slash grill at my house and i decided to include in the day's festivities an easter egg hunt in our backyard for my kids so this morning my mission was to find everything i need to make it happen and i did major at walmart and i wanted to kind of snap and talk while i was shopping but i got totally engrossed in the front of it so when i got home and i saw all my bags i was like this is so haul worthy so here we go walmart easter haul let's go i'm doing this random i'm just grabbing the bags i have so there's no particular order oh so yeah these are 12 chalkboard easter eggs i don't know about you but i'm not one for boiling a bunch of eggs mainly because we don't really eat them like that so usually once the day is over they're kind of like just there so yeah this is like the perfect solution they're eggs these are actually the ones for chalk decorating they come with the chalk and everything i did these last year my kids loved them this year though i also went and got the plain white ones and these are actually dyeable like you can use the liquid based dye kits and dye them just like you would a normal egg and they're hard and they come with paper egg holders for drying they're going to be so much fun i can't wait to do these um i probably should have put this stuff in back order since they don't back order but i also know that i got these in other colors i guess you'll see them when i get to the bag the other thing I got, and these were $1.98, so totally reasonable price, not that bad at all. This I got to decorate my table. It just says Easter with a nice little bunny, and the tea is supposed to be like a carrot. This was um, $4.84, so also not a bad price. Like, I totally got a lot of stuff for a really good price. This is to help me decorate the backyard for the egg hunt these are like signs it says egg hunt over here you're getting warmer follow me and they actually come with wooden stakes and the little paper signs and it's a set of six for 444 can't beat that like i said i totally racked up today and i can't wait to start everything for sunday um the next thing I have, this is actually going to go into my oldest daughter's Easter bag. I don't do baskets because, yeah, I just started collecting, like, Easter baskets. So instead, I just do, like, plain little gift bags, and I fill them with stuff. So this is going to be for hers. You'll see when I get through the rest of the bags. I do, like, the little normal grab bag type Easter um, Easter basket fillers, and then I usually do, like, one major present. So that's going to be her major present. So that was my first bag of stuff. And the next bag is the egg coloring kits. Now these were like, I think, I want to say like 98 cents a piece. Totally reasonable. It's the bright colors. These are going to work great on those white Easter eggs to color those. So that I got. The next thing I got, these are going to be bag fillers for their Easter bags. And they're just like card games. And they were $1.98 a piece. I have three kitties, so that means I get a card game for myself. <laughs> but um, it's Old Bunny, Crazy Eggs, a matching game, and Bunny Rummy. My kids love card games. They will actually spend like hours playing Uno and stuff. So these are great to add to their collection. Now, remember when I was talking about the one major toy for the Easter bag? This is going to be my son's. He's going to be so excited. Can't wait for him to see those. I don't want him to see them now. Thankfully, none of my kids watch my channel. Um, <laughs> these are also some really cool things I found. Can you guys see them? I'm not sure about the focus or not. But they're by Paws. And there's color snaps. They're like little Q-tips. You snap the tips and the colors come out. And they can totally decorate the other set of white eggs that I bought. So I got one for each of them. And these are going to be fun minus the mess. So you know they're like good in my book. And these were like 38 cents a piece. Seriously. This is like a Play-Doh set. This is going to be in my youngest girlie's Easter bag. Because she loves these. She decorates those little Disney princesses with them. So she's going to love this for sure. $1.98. Um, this I got for them to have bubble fun. It was a six pack and I think it was $3.48. Totally going to rock the day with those because they all love bubbles and it's a perfect outdoor type little thing. So that's bag two down. 
I don't know how these hauls are supposed to work. I think I should have been a little more organized because I'm seriously just like, I just bag the bags and I'm just like going through them. But it's my first haul, so please have patience with me. <laughs> I'm telling you though, this stuff is awesome. So, next bag is, I got these little things. My son likes this because he just likes furry stuff. I don't know, he just likes like to rub on it. I have those fur balls you put on your purse. He will sit next to my purse when we're somewhere and just like play with them. So, I got him that and these are for my two girls. And these were 98 cents a piece awesome prices right most of the stuff i got is like under a dollar or under two dollars um these are little change purses for my daughters and these are a dollar 98 each they're gonna love these they have zippers and it's just to keep their little change or lip gloss or whatever they want to keep in there these i got three of at 98 cent a piece and they're just a notebook with a pen my kids love writing little notes to each other and writing little stuff and drawing stuff so it's going to be perfect and these are going to be their buckets for the egg hunt and these were also 98 cent a piece like i said everything was under two bucks so this is for one this is for one and whoop, if i can pop this out houston we have a problem okay this is for my son. I don't know why they got stuck in there like that, but this is for my son. So that's that bag. Let's put that all back in there. That's that one. So that's gonna help them actually get their eggs and all that great stuff. And this bag is the bags. Like I said, I don't do baskets because we just ended up collecting a bunch of baskets over the years. So I usually now, I just grab like bags like this they all get the same bag and I usually make the difference between the bags by the paper I used to stuff it which um is in one of the bags coming up this is cotton candy total treat they love this stuff I got three of these they're two dollars a piece those bags by the way were 98 cents a piece so I got three of these two blues and a pink and they were two dollars a piece um this is from my oldest daughter she loves designing stuff on papers and notebooks they are color little stampers for a dollar 98 she's gonna love it and this is for buddy it's a spinning top like little game nice cool little game for 98 cents great easter basket stuffer or in my case easter bag stuffer so that's that next bag up in the haul is these are the pastel versions of the eggs and these are also the chalk ones so they can decorate these with chalk and then i got a second of the white can you guys see me the sun is like blurring right now but this is a second of the white ones for them to decorate with the color ink now this was like my best find in the whole haul like seriously and I honestly only saw one of them. So if you have a Walmart near you, hopefully they have it. If you want to do an egg hunt, it is called the Giant Egg Hunt. It comes in a giant egg, but it has every single thing I could need to do this egg hunt. Um, I'm trying to make sure you guys can see me. Hopefully I can adjust the lighting if need be. But it has 50 plastic eggs in here, 50 stickers, 25 pouches of jelly beans, 25 candy pouches, plus a golden egg for the winner of the hunt. This is like an egg hunt in one thing. So cool. I think it was $9.98. Definitely worth it. I'm just going to throw them all out in the backyard. Count to three and let them have like 60 seconds to get as many eggs as possible. Whoever gets the prize gets the prize. Ta-da! Mommy's homemade egg hunt. I think it's going to work out and I think they're going to have a blast doing it. So these are just the two other whoop, cotton candy that I was talking about. And they are were two dollars a piece like i said and then the last bag is how i'm going to distinguish their bags because i just assign them a color my oldest is always purple my youngest girl is always pink and my son is most of the time green these tend to be their colors for anything i do for them so i just got grass in their favorite colors and these grass bags were 98 cents a pop so I'm just going to fill it, and that's how I'll know which Easter bag is to use. And this is my youngest daughter's, like, major gift in her bag because she loves pocketbooks. So this is going to be her little 
major gift. I'm probably gonna have to fold it up to stick it in there, but she's gonna love it. It was a nice little tote bag for $8.97. I think this was like the priciest thing I bought besides the egg hunt in an egg. The egg hunt in an egg was $9.98 and that was $8.97. Everything else I bought was under two bucks. Way to go, right? I think I did awesome for my <laughs> very first Walmart haul. I think everything came to maybe a hundred bucks or maybe a little bit less. So that's it, guys. Wish me luck on this Easter Day grill slash cookout slash egg hunt. We are prepping like crazy, and I just can't wait to spend the day with family and have tons of fun. If you are looking for egg hunt stuff, be sure to check out your local Walmart. This is not a sponsored ad. Just as a disclosure, this is just me as a mom who found some awesome stuff and wanted to share it with you guys. I'll talk to you later, and I'll see you in the next video. Later, lovies. Just to say that I'm a wife, yes. I'm a mom, yes. And then I'm also just me. So finding that balance isn't always easy, but I try to do it by making sure I give enough time to each of those.